you have folks, Collins Model Railway, what we've done over the last few weeks, we have tidied up the storage area by air, I've put some of the locos on the track, I haven't actually tested it all out yet for the minute, we'll be doing that over the next week or more, and also what we've been doing over the last few weeks as well, you may well notice these white objects in the background, they are inclines, I've run them all the way up along here, it goes from on the flat level to 3 inches by here, at where the start of this bridge is by here, and I put this piece of board here temporary for the time being, and it elevates up to 4 inches over here. Now I tested all this track over here. She seemed to run quite fine, yeah? Now then I got these risers by here. These are elevated up to 4 inches by here. And I tested it out as far as where you could see where I got the little slight gap in the rails were there. Now what I've done over the last couple of days is from this little section by here, I have constructed this along here, put a piece of board there for the time being, temporary, and this is roughly where the elevated track is going to come. Now by here, on this section here, these are just loosely fitted all down here for the time being, and this is where all the elevated track is going to go, down so far as where you could just go see over there, maybe a couple more inches on that. Now then, what I've done this side as well, I have put some of these risers over the side by here. They need to be tidied up at the minute. They just loosely put down for the moment, give me a general idea of what I want to do. And look, so if you can quite see, the bubble is dead in the centre. So this is level. And what I plan to do now is put an elevated storage area up here. But what I might do, I might elevate this another inch. We shall come back to that in a later date. Reason being is where I got the water tower, the good shed and the engine shed. Is as I'll show you by here now. If I leave it where it is, it is going to be pretty critical to the roof of the three storage area sheds. So if I elevate it another inch, it should be plenty of room there. So we shall come back to you now in the near future with that.